I invite you to join me now as we lift up our prayers for the church and for the world. The Lord be with you. Let us pray. O Lord and maker of all things, from whose creative power the first light came forth, who looked upon the world's first morning and saw that it was good, we thank you. We thank you for this day and for your light that is all around us. We thank you for the life that stirs within each of us. We thank you for this bright and beautiful world, for the earth and the sea and the sky, the clouds and the birds. We thank you for family and for friends. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayers. And hear our prayers now for all of the world and for the church. We pray, Lord, for those who are in Mexico recovering from the earthquake. We pray, Lord, for our nation's leaders and our world leaders. We pray for President Trump, for Congress, for Governor Northam. Help and guide all leaders to govern with compassion and with justice. We pray, Lord, that you would be with scientists and researchers, that you would help them to find a vaccine for the coronavirus. And we pray that you would rid this virus from our nation and from our world. And we pray for justice and peace and love to reign in the world around us. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. We pray, Lord, for those who grieve. We pray for those in the hospital, for those recovering from surgery, for the lonely, the alone, for those who wait and watch and weep this day. We pray for those who are fighting cancer, for those who are in hospice. We pray for those who hunger and for those in financial difficulties, for those who are homeless. Bring all of these people, Lord, your help, your comfort, your strength, your healing, and your peace. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. We pray, Lord, for the church, for Reveille United Methodist Church, for Koinonia Christian Church, for Love Center of Unity, and for the church universal. May we be witnesses of your love in the world around us. May we, as a church, work for justice and to walk humbly with you and to be a people of compassion. We pray for our incoming pastor, Pete Moon, and for his wife, Lynn, and that you would bless their ministry with us. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. And now, Lord, in the silence of our hearts, we lift up to you any personal concerns that we may have. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. We thank you, Lord, for your power and for your presence that is, with, that is with us in days of joy as well as in days of pain and struggle. We thank you most of all for your Son, Jesus Christ, who is our greatest gift to us. And now we lift up to you the prayer that Jesus taught us to pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. 
Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen.